So here we are inside the default Blender scene. This is Blender version 4.3. And I just want to show you how you can easily set up a terrain with a thermal node. We already have this cube selected. Now let's add another window. Let's go to the asset browser. And here I'm going to use AAA nodes. I don't need these categories. Okay, and here I'll just, actually we can use this window here, go to Geometry Notes Editor, let's make a new Geometry Notes modifier, we can see it here, and now let's drag this, so we need a Terminal node. And we need something that we'll use as a base surface for the terrain. So let's use maybe, I don't know, grid, like so. So we have three vertices, three by three. Uh, this will be a plane which will have four faces. So let's plug this here. And let's plug this here. Okay. And we need something to activate the Terminal node, which will then help us generate the surface of the terrain. So we can use, for example, Bezier Curve. Something like this. We'll pin this Geometry Nodes modifier, so we can always have it selected. And now we will drag and drop this Bezier curve here. And if we make this bigger, you will see here it says B influencer slash activator. So this can also be a geometry such as, uh, I don't know, sphere or anything like that. But for now, we'll use this uh, curve and then we'll add some faces to it by setting the profile so let's first plug this you see not much is happening because it has to be a mesh so let's add curve to mesh and also let's add a circle curve circle We'll set this resolution to maybe 8, that will be enough, and radius maybe to 0 0.1. We'll see if we'll need to change that. So let's plug this here, plug this here, and plug this here. Okay, so here's your terrain. You can check other videos about how to do changes here. Uncheck some values here. I can make it invert and many other magical things that you can set so yeah this is how we do it